I want to introduce you to two great people, Robert Matheson and Katherine Saunders. It, from a great brand, Robert Red, which I don't know if all of you have heard about, but this is a big deal in Newport. Like when you walk around Newport, you see the striped shirts and then you know, oh, they know about the Robert Red story. That's right, yeah. And We're pretty proud of that. It, it's, let me just, before, this is more than just a shirt though, it's a story. It's based on a legend. Tell me about the legend of Robert Red. Well, the, 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 as the premise of the brand goes, we market through the legend of Robert Redd as opposed to a cult of personality, say, through me or through Catherine. The brand is based on a lifestyle of integrity and love and character. And so when you wear a Robert Redd shirt or Robert Redd products or you use the Bloody Mary mix or any of the other products we produce, what you're really doing is you're living your own lifestyle you're not dependent on a polo pony or some other logo, label. some other label. So. And it's, yet it's becoming its own cult following in part because, Catherine, I know that people at home can't feel this, but the shirts just get softer and softer and they last. I mean, people have them for 10 years and they still look the same. I love the shirts. They're 100% Peruvian Pima cotton, so they really are the softest things in the world and, and our customers tell us that and they love it and kids love it and men love it. And, we just think that women will love it just the same. Because we're launching, you're launching a new Lady Red, which will be a ladies brand. I know some of my kids, uh, Julian has the little shirt, and mm -hmm. Dennis has a shirt, and that's what's so great, is the whole family, so when you're out vacationing in Newport or Nantucket or wherever, you can all wear the cute shirts together. But the ladies line is what's being launched, and this is happening more and more. I've noticed this on Facebook. You're going through kickstarter.com, which means the people, you the viewers at home, have the choice if you can make this happen through kickstarter.com. How does that work? Well, if they go to kickstarter.com and type in Robert Red R-E-D-D, they'll come to our Kickstarter project page and there we're raising capital to um, fund the, uh, the launch of the ladies line. And Catherine's wearing a, a prototype shirt. This is another prototype shirt. There's some shirts here on the table and a shirt dress as well. And you go on and you pledge money to it, but but you're pledging at different levels. Yeah. It's not an investment. Right, you, could, you might get part. a shirt, you might get this. And I've seen some of this come out. Now, I was asking you earlier, why do people do this? Instead of going to get a loan, it's now becoming the cool thing that people are supporting small businesses. Why do you think that is? Well, it's the convergence of technology, number one, and social networking, and people taking more control over what they're interested in, in uh, encouraging. So we're not dependent so much on venture capital or private equity anymore people can decide for themselves what they want to see rise and fall. It's so, kind of an interesting premise. So if you love Catherine's shirt and you want to just wash something that's going to get softer and softer and softer, I have to say that I use a lot of the spray and wash on Julian's shirts. The stains come out. I don't yeah. know, maybe it's because it's such a good cotton, but everything comes out and it always looks good. So if people are seeing this and they say, hey, I want to make this happen, I want, I want to support a small business, you can just do it yourself. Right, we tell them to go to kickstarter.com. Kickstarter.com. So we've got about a week to get this done. In the meantime, I just want to say there's some beautiful art around here and every color is a different story. So the legend of Robert Red is Incorporate, incorporates these color stories which every uh, product has a different color and therefore a different color story and like some of the artwork on the table or this original painting is done by my father to sort of tell the f further legend of the uh, for the story of the legend and so every color story gives you a, a, a insight into the Robert Red legend. And it's all historical fiction, so the stories, though Robert Red is fictional, the stories that happened all around the world, from Persia to wherever, yeah. are true. So you learn a little bit, so if you love literature, you love summer, history, history back to 1877. And you want a shirt that the stains come out and it lasts, and, yeah. then you go to Robert Red. So I love the idea that we can make this happen, so check it out on Facebook, kickstarter.com. You can be a part of launching another line for a small business, yeah. it's awesome. Robert, Catherine, thank you, thank you so much for making the thank trip out to so Better Connecticut. Scott? All right, coming back, we are going to be with food, foodie fatale, Jocelyn Ruggiero. She's a lot of fun, and there's some beautiful things set up in that kitchen. So come on back and join us right here on Better Connecticut.